A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Jesus said to the Pharisees, There was a rich man who dressed in purple garments and fine linen, and dined sumptuously each day. And lying at his door was a poor man named Lazarus, covered with sores, who would gladly have eaten his fill of the scraps that fell down from the rich man's table. Dogs even used to come and lick his sores. When the poor man died, he was carried away by angels to the bosom of Abraham. The rich man also died and was buried, and from the netherworld, where he was in torment, he raised his eyes and saw Abraham far off and Lazarus at his side. And he cried out, Father Abraham, have pity on me. Send Lazarus to dip the tip of his finger in water and cool my tongue, for I am suffering torment in these flames. Abraham replied, My child, remember that you received what was good during your lifetime, while Lazarus likewise received what was bad. But now he is comforted here, whereas you are tormented. Moreover, between us and you, a great chasm is established to prevent anyone from crossing who might wish to go from our side to yours or from your side to ours. He said, Then I beg you, Father, send him to my father's house, for I have five brothers, so that he may warn them, lest they too come to this place of torment. But Abraham replied, They have Moses and the prophets. Let them listen to them. He said, Oh no, Father Abraham, but if someone from the dead goes to them, they will repent. Then Abraham said, If they will not listen to Moses and the prophets, neither will they be persuaded if someone should rise from the dead. The Gospel of the Lord They have Moses and the prophets. The Gospel parable underscores Jesus' teaching on the proper use of wealth and sensitivity to the plight of a fellow human being. The contrast between the rich man and the poor man Lazarus highlights great divide between the two. Divides enjoys the comfort and luxury of life and Lazarus lies helpless and suffering at his door. In the other life, however, Lazarus enjoys peace and comfort at the bosom of Abraham, while Dives is tormented in the netherworld. The parable is a strong warning to those who will not listen to Moses and the prophets, and Jesus himself, who call on everyone to listen to the cries of the poor. Khalil Gibran, the Lebanese-American author, writes, A man's true wealth is a good he does in the world.